guys, welcome back to I Learn Vlog channel, a space where we talk about everything and anything cryptocurrency. In today's video, I would be talking about mainnet and testnet. So kindly hit the like and subscribe buttons and we will keep the videos coming. Have you ever done a test drive for a vehicle you were willing to purchase? Well, we do this every time to see whether the car is worth it or whether it meets certain requirements before making the final purchase. Similarly, there are two networks of blockchain and that is the testnet and the mainnet. Mainnet is also known as the main network. It is the ecosystem of connected nodes that executes real transactions that have real value, like sending BTC to your friend in the US. And these transactions are publicly available for everyone to see. Anyone who does a transaction of any kind on the mainnet has to pay a certain fee called the gas fee. And the amount of money is dependent on the network use, just like refilling your car before you use it. The owner of the node who confirms the transaction's authenticity is paid some part of the gas fee as a reward for their effort. A mainnet is an open source blockchain and it establishes a, a factor of trust. Any project that does not have a mainnet is still a concept. Now let's talk about testnet. Testnet is also known as test network. It is an exact replica of an original blockchain. It follows the same consensus as mainnet, but unlike mainnet, it, the transactions on a testnet hold no value. They are not original and the tokens are dummy, just like a monopoly game. Performance on a network is basically used to evaluate the fundamental development on the network, like security, transaction finality, and so on and so forth. So developers use testnet to access the functionality of their decentralized applications and smart contracts before deploying them on mainnet. Because anything once deployed on mainnet cannot be reversed. So testnet helps in rigorous testing. In testnet, there are no deployment and transaction fees incurred. Just like the way you don't need to fill your car whenever you are doing a test drive. Alright, so that would be all on testnet and mainnet. I hope you found this video educative and exciting. Alright, so I will be back with more educational videos like this. Please stay tuned and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. See you in the next video.